The One UI 7 update has finally rolled out for the Samsung M34 5G smartphone. This update was actually released quite a few days ago but I completely forgot to update my mobile phone. The update size is 3653.46 MB and the security patch has been upgraded to May 2025. There is a huge list of changes in the changelog. You can pause the video and check it out if you are interested. In this video, I'm going to share my personal experience after updating the phone. Along with that, I will also show you some Geekbench and 3D Mark test results, both before and after the update. We will compare and observe the performance scores. And finally, I will share some photo and video samples taken before and after the update. The update took around 10 to 12 minutes to complete. Make sure you don't press any buttons while the phone is updating. After installing this One UI 7 update, I checked for updates again and yes, there was another one available. It was a security patch update for August 2025 with a size of 281.86 MB. I downloaded and installed that successfully as well. Coming to the changes, you will notice the new notification panel, new widgets, new ringtones, new battery icon and more. You can also check out the Samsung One UI comparison video I uploaded recently for a side by side look. Overall, yes, there are noticeable visual and functional changes after installing this update. Now let's move on to the 3D Mark and Geekbench test. I tried my best to start the test with a 100% battery but please take the battery percentage as secondary here. The Samsung M series already offers a big battery and decent performance for the price. In the 3D Mark Wildlife Extreme Stress Test, the stability actually improved after the One UI 7 update. So overall, looking at the numbers, we can confidently say the performance has improved. Next, I ran the Geekbench CPU performance test. Let's see what the results are. And just to note, before doing these tests, I made sure the phone was at similar temperatures both times. After the update, I allowed the phone to cool down before running any benchmark tests. Coming to the scores, as you can see, there are noticeable improvements in both single core and multi core performance. It's good to see that One UI 7 brings some solid improvements to this phone. Next, I ran the GPU performance test. Let's see how those results turned out. As you can see, while the GPU improvement isn't huge, the numbers are still slightly higher after the One UI 7 update. Now, let's take a look at some images captured at different zoom levels. From my observation, there is no major improvement or a decline in overall image quality. The file sizes of the photos also remain almost identical. Some shots may appear brighter but that's mostly due to sunlight differences while capturing. Next, here is a 4K 30fps video recorded at different zoom levels. Again, it looks almost the same as before. The difference in brightness is mainly due to the different recording times and lighting conditions, not because of any improvements or downgrade in quality after the update. When checking the video file sizes, they are also practically the same. After using the phone for about 48 hours, I found the battery backup to be almost the same as before. In fact, there is a slight improvement but nothing major. Also, I didn't notice any lags, green line issues or glitches during my usage. All apps, files and data remained intact. There was no data wipe after the update. So finally, yes, you can definitely go ahead and update on your phone. You will notice improvements in CPU performance and some visual and functional changes across the system. Also, I'll be soon uploading a dedicated long term review video on how this phone performs after these many years. So if you don't want to miss that, make sure to subscribe to the channel and tap the bell icon beside it. See you again in the next one.